What's up guys, my name is Elio Tabrizi, I'm a filmmaker and welcome to Captive Emotions. This week I want to talk about one of my favorite continuous lights by Light and Motion and that is the Stella Pro CLX10 and uh, it's my go-to light for photography, videography and filmmaking. So today I want to go over some of the features and reasons why I really love this light. So let's talk about some of its main features. The Stella Pro CLX10 is a continuous LED daylight at 5600 Kelvin. It comes with an integrated battery that runs from 46 minutes at its full power up to 15 hours at its minimum power. It is protected by IP54 rating, which means uh, that it's protected in unpredictable weather conditions such as dust and rain. It is flicker free up to 1000 frames per second. It comes with an umbrella hold mount, a C-stand mount, and also you can just handheld it because it is very small and is easy to hold. Uh, some of the other features about this uh, light is that it has an interchangeable light modifier that is a direct mount in the front. You can easily switch it and uh, use different light modifiers that we're going to go over those in the next video. So this light particularly it works with most of LN Chrome uh, light modifiers and you don't have to buy an adapter for it you just directly mount on the light modifier. So the other thing about this light is that it has an interchangeable head that you can change it from daylight to tungsten very easily and just plug it back in so the Stella Pro CLX 10 is very user friendly and it has only three buttons in the top and a knob so this is just to turn on and off knob and there's a menu button and two buttons just to control the intensity of the light so you have an option to control it through the light itself or you can also get the EL uh, remote control and control the intensity wirelessly. So another good feature about this light is the capabilities of charging it. So first of all we talked about the integrated battery that runs from 15 hours uh, to 46 minutes. In addition you have a power adapter here that you can just plug it in and charge it directly which you don't have to be worrying about the battery at all so the other good option is that you can unplug the external power from the top and plug in a d-tap adapter and you can connect it to your v-mount or your gold mount battery and run your power off of a, a v mount or a gold mount battery just like that so let's check out the intensity of the light we're going to start at 500 lumens and go all the way up to 10,000 lumens just uh, one thing about the light is that it's very powerful so you want to make sure that you're not uh, pointing it directly at anyone's eyes so we're going to point it at the ceiling and bounce off the light from the ceiling. So this is at 500 lumens, 1000, 2000, 4000, 6000, 8000, and its maximum power at 10,000. So one thing to mention about uh, the Stella Pro CLX10 that it has an internal fan that it does not become activated up to 60% uh, or 6,000 lumens. Even prior to that, maybe it is activated, but it's very low that you cannot even hear it. So this doesn't affect you in photography or maybe in uh, videography, but if you're making the film, uh, the sound of the fan, it's kind of it's kind of annoying and that is one thing that I don't like about this light is only the sound of the fan so if I turn it on and you can hear it 
and this is at um, maximum power 10,000 so if I reduce it 8,000 and 6,000 is barely noticeable and at 4,000 that's where the fan is already off so um, that's one thing to keep in mind about the, these lights I hope you guys like this video and uh, in the next few days we're gonna go over some other uh, features of this light the menu and also the direct mounts and some other light modifiers that you can use with the Stella Pro so make sure you you share you like uh, leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell see you guys